Before starting to disassemble the machine, we need to take out the honeycomb panel and dropout tray inside the machine. These two parts may fall and damage parts inside the machine during transportation. Now we need to turn off the power and remove the warning light on the machine. This is to ensure that there is no greater risk of collision during the process of passing through the door. Here is a tip. When disassembling the connecting cable, be sure to remember the position of each cable so that it can be accurately corresponded during subsequent installation to ensure a smooth operation. The next step is to remove the six fixing screws on the left and right sides of the bottom of the machine. These screws hold the main body of the machine and the base together and must all be removed. Remove the side door panels on both sides of the machine to reduce the weight of the machine. Finally, unplug all connecting wires and remove the exhaust pipe. Now that the main body and base of the machine are separated, we can pass them through a normal sized door respectively. This allows the entire machine to be transported to the target location. With these simple steps, we successfully disassembled and moved this large machine into the room. Hope this video helps you.